understand why the cuck looks uh, like. I nice can understand person. people being cucks, you know, in a way. It's kind of hot. That sounds like you are a cuck. Like, 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 think about like this though. Think about like this. If you cut someone, then there's a little bit of like blood foreplay and like some of that stuff. Okay. Oh wait, you were talking about cuck or cut? Cut. Oh, okay, I see. Now, blood fetish, I like am strangely into, and I actually do have a couple pictures with it in it. In it, like, yeah, I don't know. There's something interesting about blood. Blood, blood play is different. Yeah, I don't, I don't understand cucks. Yeah, I was about to say, are you a cuck, dude? Mm, thinking emoji. Thinking emoji. <laughs> Pretty much. It's definitely one of those things. Yeah. Do you think it's like, it's something that happens like they plan it out or they just accept the cuck lifestyle after like years of failure? I think it's the lifestyle after years of failure, but there's actually a reverse cuck where you want your girlfriend to have sex with a shitty male, like a little shitty guy, and then you come in the dominator in front of him. That's something else, but what it has the a different fuck? fetish. Like the idea is that you set him up with like a crappy guy that just, I don't know, this little scrawny bitch, and then after you know, push him out of the way, then you properly fuck her. That has a different fetish. That I might be able to get into. But it's is that a, being a It's cuck? kind of mean to the guy, but as long as he's <laughs> not your friend, I guess it's okay, right? You know, if I could find maybe like a scrawny, shitty guy that hasn't had sex and is bad at sex, maybe I could do it. You know, somebody... Mm. It's, right, it's right there at the tip of my tongue. You know, Ooh, the a tip of my thing. penis. <laughs> I wonder. Yeah, thinking thinking of emoji. emoji. <laughs> <laughs> Say, you know, we can fix each other's problems here. Ooh, thinking emoji. I'll have to. I'll have to see. Is is my self-esteem at risk? The answer is maybe. Is it worth it? Well, that's that's a good question. Um, yeah, we'll talk about it. Yeah, we'll talk about it. All right, change the topic. <laughs> god damn it. Oh god damn. Let's talk about Justin Anthony. Hey, Justin Anthony. Eight. Just, just Anthony is the man with the plan. God, if this game is loud. Oof. Yo. Hey, what time is it over there? Wherever you are, Anthony. I'm, I'm the man, not with the plan, but rather with the meme. You know. With the meme. Where are you from? What? What country are you from? Um, Ukraine. Ukraine, I thought so. Yeah. Yeah. No. What time is it in Ukraine land? Um, Ukraine land. Wow! <laughs> wow! <laughs> almost, almost 11 p.m. Man, what about you? Like, what time is it for you? He's he's great driving place. through the Great Barrier Reef. <laughs> I'm destroying it single-handedly. Can, can, nice. can you destroy some cartels for me? Cartels? You know? Cartels? Yeah, cartels. Like no, where? I can't do that. Like quotes. the mafia? Yeah, no, I All can't right. do that. Yeah, we we can do that. No, no, no. We're we're ex CIA, special ops unit. Oh. Spanish was the the sniper. I was the binocular man. You ever see the binocular man spotter. in the it's the army man toys? Oh, it was a spotter. Yeah, I, a binocular man sounds more technical, binocular more intelligent. Man. <laughs> <laughs> binocular, <laughs> binocular man. Oh man. Jesus. And there's always the minesweeper nobody wanted. Nobody wanted to be the minesweeper. Who wants to die? Oh, ah! Ow! Ow! Whoa! Ah! This game, this game randomly gets like really loud out of weird portions. No, I can't say you do that. I mean, the game should surprise you, right? Like, it shouldn't be boring for you. And when this gets boring, <laughs> boom! Loud sounds. Dave Info has a glitch where it like, will turn the volume, volume all the way up. No matter how much you try to turn on the volume of the game, it will flash it all the way up. I don't know what it is about that game, but it has a big problem with that. Some, some games, like some games use like, just really loud music and you just can't hear them at all. This one, um, yeah. this one the sound effects are just like, whoa. And then people scream oh. too. Damn. Is it that one scream you said you heard in the... Uh, no, the not movie? the Wilhelm scream. That's uh, that's a different <laughs> meme. I watched that movie and I heard it and I was like, <laughs> Why did you see this sound? It's a funny sound. It's I know, like, but it's, it's like, so recognizable, you know? It's so meme -y. Yeah. 
Oh god, I'm getting my ass stomped in this Fire game. Incoming. I like that you're getting your ass stomped. I do like myself getting my ass stomped. It is that kind Ooh. of fetish. Oh. oh. Oh, I remember. I have a super unit, though. I'm good. I've got the power of air. You know what we should do? We should open up our own pizza shop, I think. Raffles Pizza Emporium. With, with special sauce. Yeah, with special sauce. Quote, quote, quote on special. Oh, that's why. Wow, special I'm a retard. <laughs> I cranked up the sound effects volume all the way up in my last playthrough. Wow. No wonder. No wonder. Dude. Dude. Me complain. Dude. Oh. Daggers don't do any damage at all. Who would have Who would have known? While well, I was here in Cincinnati, we went to look at a, a property to potentially open some, like, the guy, the guy's pitch was a, a taco place that was like a bar, but it would deliver tacos as well. It's supposed to be like a small, like, city kind of place. And it looked pretty good, but I don't know if I was convinced. So we could do taco pizza or something like that, you know? Yeah, personally, I don't like to, you know, eat, go to a place to live at just for tacos. That's my personal opinion, you know? Tacos aren't really a, um, like the deal breaker food for me, at the very least, you know? Yeah, but I'm more moved for money, you know? So if the taco place leaves money, then it's like, I. Yeah. You know, because owning a business is a little different than, you know, working for a business. You we know what do, I'm talking about. I'm we sure. can do ramen. Let's do it. We're not, we're not Japanese, but I bet you we can do ramen. I mean, how hard is it? You just put the noodles in the microwave, right? And then it's done. Practically. I mean, you, New York has the advantage where you could probably do kind of any kind of food and it might hit because you just have such a dense area. So it would be kind of different New York. Yeah, we have a lot of stupid people. Yeah. Also, also we can wear those Naruto cosplay things. No, we're not oh, doing yeah. Naruto cosplay. Yeah, what? Aww. Yeah. Aww. Aww. Okay, can we, can we wear lobster things? Like, costumes? What? Mobster costumes? The, the lobster ramen costumes. mobster plays. No, he's Man, saying a lobster a costume. Oh, yeah. lobster. Okay. Yeah, no, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, we can... Yeah, from a Amanda show? Yeah, we can do that, dude. Yeah. And, and Ruffle will be fucking Manta Ray. <laughs> yeah, I'll be, I'll be a Manta Ray, dude. I swear, at the end of Moana, I so wanted to be that fucking Manta Ray that that grandma bitch became. I was dude, like, how many dude. Times you watch Moana? <laughs> I love Moana, dude. Dude, why do you watch it so much? It's really worrying. Moana's fucking amazing, dude. I guess so, huh? It's Here's a question I have to exciting. ask you. Why don't you watch Moana? I've never seen Moana. I, I was trying how to sing this song <laughs> from Moana. Go ahead, sing it for us. Sing it. Anthony. I want to hear it in Ukraine. <laughs> wow, but but this please English, talk like... please talk to me in Slav. Oh oh wait I will I will fucking do this. Okay. Oh my God the orcs are savage. Redvan, hey. They killed their own guys to get to my. What's up, Redvan? Nothing much. Nothing much. I'm playing a Warhammer 40k game. Oh my Nelly, he did a hundred damage with one swing. How is that even possible? Oh wait, he has a big fucking stick. I guess anything's I possible. Named, I knew a girl named Nellie in high school and she uh she got depression and pulled all her hair out. Oh. That's cool. Yeah, that's pretty yeah, that's kinda cool. You got any like classmates who have had it like just the worst after high school? The worst, ha just have it like the worst. I'm sorry. You're yeah. Out a bit. Oh yeah, no, like that. The absolute worst. Like they're just like hell went all over their lives. Yeah, I I've had a couple. Yeah, I can think of like good three or four. Also, have you had any classmates die yet that you knew in high school? No, not yet. Thankfully, oh, or any man, I cared about. about. Four, four or five. Oh god, that sucks. I mean, I don't really care because you know whatever they're dead. 
just kind of interesting to think about like their whole life was encompassed in mine you know like their time their time on this earth ended before mine so like i know the end of their story you know in a way i don't know yeah. there's something about that to kind of think about yeah i sometimes think about that too it's like you gotta live in the in the present almost so that you don't yeah. like waste a life kind of just thinking about the future yeah i don't ever plan more than like three months ahead Everything ahead of that is kind well, of Well, there has to be like a like an end end tier plan, right? Like something along those yeah. lines. I guess so, but it's kind of more of a notion like, and like less of a goal, invasion right? Invasion of India or something? I don't know. Uh, yeah, I could do that. Extermination of India, rather. Oh, okay. You yeah, know what's fucking... the difference, honestly? I'm gonna need a lot of ammunition. There's a lot of people there. <laughs> I mean, I can send you some. I wonder what the cost efficiency per round is if you could kill like eight Indians with 150 cal versus <laughs> nine mils, right? Because how much are nine mils worth individually? Like, is it, would you save money by using 50 cal Geico? and lining them up instead? <laughs> like, lining them up might be cheaper, right? Man, you have, you have a big vendetta. <laughs> You're like the Punisher. <laughs> But only with India, apparently. It's just a joke, you know? I don't hate it. It's just the meme. Oh, I'm gonna get you one day to debate about this, though. One day. What? You're gonna get me to debate about it? Yeah, one day. I want, I want okay. you and Binary Nerd to butt heads again like you did in that Forts game. Oh, that was really funny. <laughs> that was so funny. You were being so mean to him. I know. I, know, it's, I, I, like, I like Binary a lot. I don't know. I just think it's funny to be mean to him. Because <laughs> then he gets he gets really salty and he goes on yeah, a big rant. Rowdy. Yeah. rowdy. That's I don't a, see him here that often. Yeah, because he works a lot. He's a music person. I don't know if that's a real job, uh, but oh well. You know, I'm a music man. I'm a music man. Is a music man a real job? Do people even listen so. to music anymore? People down in the comments, do you listen to the beep boop dubstep or <laughs> like, like what do you do? You don't listen to instruments. You guys have a, a musician in your house, in your manor? Let us know. I'd love to have a musician in my house. Yeah, to. like a, a quote unquote slave. Yeah. Um, okay, Sounds yeah. That my butt is doing, does this count as music? What your butt is doing is considered music? Yeah. Uh, yeah what is your butt doing? doing? I mean, beautiful sons, you know. You have a kazoo in your asshole? Wow. I thought, I thought we were friends. Do you know what a kazoo is? Yeah. It's like an instrument, right? You just like go... Yeah. I always thought that was like the the instrument of the autism. Like I just I can never understand someone actually going up, picking up a kazoo yeah. and going, yeah, this isn't annoying. Let's Have play you ever or tried playing one? No, I haven't. It's hard. It's not easy to play one of those things. I have to. I'm just very judgmental to the kazoo. I actually collect a lot of random mis miscellaneous and obscure instruments. I have quite. Oh, I that's your autistic quirk. I have a lot of autistic quirks, dude. You should uh, see my house. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm filled with autism to the brim. To the brim. It's just high class, you know. Disguised as intelligent. You own a fedora? <laughs> Fuck no. All right, you're not that bad then. No, trust me. I can't no. understand. I can't understand fedoras. That is me the neither. one thing I refuse to ever acknowledge. And then the people are like, "It's a tribly." It's like, who cares? You're a faggot either way. Fedoras or um, trench coats. Trench coats are just the the worst. The absolute. If you keep ripping. If you keep ripping on these things, you might lose a bunch of subs on this vid. You know. Oh, that's true. <laughs> but I mean, like, change your fashion. That's trench coats are really stupid. Trench coats just make you look like a school shooter. Which don't get me wrong, is a look that I like, but yeah. still, most of the time yeah. you're a skinny Columbine? Oh, that was in style. They were stylish when yeah, they shot stylish. that. Yeah, stylish. It looked good, is all I'm saying. How many kids died in Columbine, anyway? Like 15? I don't. Actually, I don't know. 
I just threw out 15 as an oddball number. I can't think of 100. Do you think they mowed down hundreds of dudes? Oh my god, I gotta no. look this up. This. I think it's around 40. 40 kids died in Columbine? I, it's a guess. I'm not sure. Shit, why, did they, why did they do it? I don't know. I need to look this up. I need, I need to do knows, this for science. Nobody knows why the Vegas guy shot up the country concert. Like, nobody knows. Nobody still does it. They have no clue as to why he did Damn, it. Damn, they had 99 explosive devices and car bombs. What? That's a lot. That is a crazy amount of planning. How many people did they kill? Um, 15. Sad. Including both perpetrators, yeah. And then 24 I mean, non-fatal injuries. So it's like a lot of prep for not a lot of performance. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, they didn't take that Viagra. Yeah. No, oh, this guy was on antidepressant drug, and the antidepressants didn't work. What is with antidepressants not working? What's what's the why? Why is that a meme? Because uh, there's not some magic pill that's going to cure the fucking neural synapses in your brain because it's about wiring and it's less about, you know, some random chemical that's going to fix you. I've put a lot of thought on how the brain works and the way it works is the more you entertain a thought is the more you strengthen the neural synapse connections and it's, it's a matter of wiring. So your brain's amorphous and constantly, it's constantly connecting and disconnecting, remembering and not remembering things. So the more you think about something, the more it wires itself permanently in your head. So it's not, some pill's not going to fix that. Mm. Sure, you can dampen the connections between the neural synapses, synapses, but <clears throat> that just makes you not feel anything, which is not really that much better. Yeah. That's why whenever someone's on antidepressants, they're all zombied out. That's why I don't watch anime. Mm. That's actually a good point. Because it's, it's stimulating that sense of like, oh, she's so cute but it's a cartoon. It's like you shouldn't you shouldn't have that neural synapse connected. What about people who want to fuck Rainbow Dash? What do you think that that deal is? Wow. Don't get me started on those people, dude. <laughs> Holy shit. Is, like, that that too... You know there's a there's a cult in Russia that worships the um the little rabbit or little mouse thing from the Great Mouse Detective, the the little um the the pilot girl. Um she's worshiped um... as like a god or something. Oh, you're talking about uh, the mechanic rabbit. Yeah, yeah. She's not a rabbit. She's a mouse. Oh, uh, she's a name? mouse. The same thing. What's her name, though? Uh, I, I don't know. Name. I, I know what you're talking about. There's a fetish around her specifically, which is super fucking weird. It's so weird. It's so weeby. God damn it. Oh, what's her name? Uh, God, it bothers me because I knew it at one point. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I don't need to. All right, the video's over. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, but if you want to support the channel, then join in on the Patreon as well as on Discord where you can join in on some gaming sessions. Bye bye